Hey guys, this is me Rachet Jan. Welcome to yet another video. I'm very, very, very happy to announce that we have finally crossed 10,000 subscribers. I'm really very, very happy and excited about it and I look forward to grow more. Coming back to today's video, today we will be talking about how to get software engineering jobs post your graduation. So maybe you are just in your last semester in your university or maybe you have just graduated from your college and you are working in some company but you are not happy there. In this video, I will be sharing how you can get started with the interview process in your dream company. To get started with the interview process, you have a bunch of options like you can ask for referrals or you can go to LinkedIn and use that or you can go to the careers website of that company. Today we will be covering about all these things. Number one, applying on the careers portal. So guys, maybe you want to work for Microsoft, maybe you want to work for Amazon, Goldman Sachs or Google or maybe or or maybe some other startup so each company is having their careers portal page and you can search about it on google or bing or any other search engine that you want but you can navigate to their careers website page and then navigate and explore various job opportunities that are over there and you can register on their pro, uh, the, you can register on their website and then upload your details like resume and apply for the jobs that you want for example at careers.microsoft.com you can see a bunch of software engineering jobs you can filter out based on location based on the level and all those things and then you can finally read the job description what is the minimum qualification and things like that and then apply for that job on the portal so this is one of the easiest ways to get connected with the HR of that company they will go through your resume they will you will receive an acknowledgement mail the moment you uh, apply to the careers website and they will tell you that they might reach out to you in future if they are interested and they want to go further with your profile coming to the success ratio about this process believe me guys it's really very very much successful you might think that this won't work and your profile and and your mail won't be even noticed but that's not the case the people at that company will go through your mails and look at your profile and definitely get back to you if they are interested so this is a short shot and you must try that out if they are not interested they will even reach out thanking you for displaying interest in your in their organization number two getting referrals so a lot of people in comments told how to get referrals and how can we get referrals in dream companies and what if we do not know some person who is working in that particular organization so I will be answering that over here referrals are the best way I would say to get started with your interview process in the firm that you want to work for so let's say if you want to work for Amazon and you ask one of the Amazon employee to refer yourself he will submit your resume and other details and why he thinks you are a good hire for the company and the HR will go through that and reach out to you and start off with your interview process you, you might get rejected because of your resume but that's fine you can ask for some reason why that happened and maybe you can work on it so that your resume is shortlisted in the future when you apply to that company the next time so don't get disheartened if you do not uh, if you get rejected just ask them what is the cooling period so this happens a lot of time you are applying for some job and even if your interview process gets started and you get rejected it's still fine guys you can wait for some cool down period like for Google and Microsoft it's around six months so you can apply to that company again after six months and then you can hope to get started with the interview process and maybe next time you can clear your coding interview coming back to answering how to get referrals um, I think Facebook is the best tool for that you might not even know uh, the power of social media that can help you in achieving the dream jobs that you want so in this case you can simply log into your Facebook profile and you can simply make a search like friends who work at Amazon and th you can see for all the results for friends who work at Amazon to elaborate this search you can search for people who work at Amazon so that even friends of friends are included so once you do that search you can simply connect you can simply find out if you know someone who is really close to you and they might be working at the company that you want to work for so maybe you can then say something like hey I am so glad to find out that you work at Amazon could you please give me a referral it will speed up the timelines of my interview process 
This is me in short. I graduated in 2017 from IIT Roorkee, currently a software engineer at Microsoft. I am highly skilled in data structures and algorithms. In fact, I teach a bit about them on my YouTube channel. So basically, what you have to do is just don't write a long paragraph and share a little bit about yourself, a little bit unique about yourself and what you are really strong at. And then just say them that I think I am ready to crack the Amazon coding interview. I just I'm just looking out for a chance. And then do share your resume and don't share a PDF, guys. Just share a Google Drive link so that they can they simply have to click and it will open in a browser and they don't have to download and open it. So if you share a link, the probability of that getting clicked is a bit higher. Of course, you this is an example and you can tweak it based on your situation. Once you do this, the conversation will open up. You can you have expressed your interest. and then you can simply request them for a referral and if you are not knowing someone maybe facebook can tell you and if that list is empty maybe none of your friends are working at amazon or something like that you can explore uh, you can extend that search to people who work at amazon and maybe there are some friends of friends who are working there and then you can ask your mutual friends to introduce yourself to them and then you can maybe ask them for a referral moving on to the last one Number three is contacting recruiters at LinkedIn, and and again this is very very successful sometimes. So, um, in fact, you can also search about hiring managers at LinkedIn, and how this works is you simply log into your LinkedIn profile, and you simply search like uh, recruiters at Google maybe, and then you can apply filters like location is California or location is India to get the profile of right recruiters. because maybe you are interested in working abroad like maybe you are in india and you want to uh, work for google in california or something like that so you can basically search for recruiters in whatever geography that you are interested in and then you can send them an invite with a small note and once they accept your invite you can open up a conversation and explain your interest in that organization for example this is a sample you can say something like hi thanks for accepting my invite i am a software engineer at microsoft and looking out to make a switch to google I have worked for around 2 years as a software developer and feel my skills are ready to crack an interview. Can you please take out a few minutes to talk about my interest, my resume and again guys, sharing a Google Drive link is better I think, but if you are talking to a recruiter maybe you can share a PDF. I'm not sure about that, but um this is a sample and of course you can tweak it and change various sentences, but the overall idea is to just, you know, be short to the point. tell them that you feel you are ready and you are interested in working at their organization and tell where you are working right now and share your resume of course and just request them to take out a few minutes to talk about your interest in their firm i hope this video was useful to you i kept it short and crisp and to the point so that i don't waste much of your time but anyways let me know in comments what do you think about this so if you like this video hit the like button share this video and subscribe to my channel if you want to see more of me